I was particularly pleased that last year we were able to launch some fantastic physical spaces and some fantastic examples of the investment we're getting into Jersey's digital sector with the opening of the Digital Jersey Exchange at the beginning of the year and towards the end of the year, the opening of an expanded, refurbished Digital Jersey Hub and of course the Digital Jersey Academy and the launch of the Digital Leadership Program. Jersey is a unique place to be able to do groundbreaking work that the rest of the world can learn from. So this is just tremendous futurism. Our members are the heart of the island's tech community, which is growing year on year. At Digital Jersey, you get access to a collaborative group of tech professionals who share ideas, opportunities and information. The opportunity to try things across the whole spectrum of tech solutions in one place with a fantastic infrastructure ready is something that we really think is an opportunity that our industry and Tech UK want to get hold of, champion and take advantage of. People can come here and do it for real in a manageable bite-sized way that make it pertinent to the rest of the world. For a long time, people in Jersey have said, why would technology companies come to Jersey to test their products? Well, today we've heard why, because we've got infrastructure that they, they can't believe we have, that they don't have in the UK. We've got everything anyone would need in a small contained location and amazing people connectivity as well as digital connectivity. In October, we held the Digital Jersey Smart Island Roundtable. We brought together industry and government in prioritising the adoption of technology to make Jersey a smarter island. We've always thought of Jersey as a testing environment for us. Sandbox Jersey is exactly that. To have the teaching space linked with the place where people can actually have their projects laid out along the benches, the soldering stations, the 3D printers, actually build the prototypes to turn their dreams into reality. That's something really special. We've managed to capture uh, shots from all over Jersey and some really unique places that people wouldn't normally be allowed to get to and access. We need to embrace technology, we need to embrace the digital sector, we need to grow our artificial intelligence, make advantage of our tremendous digital infrastructure. Welcome to the second Jersey Tech Awards and yet again tonight we can prove what a successful and diverse industry we already have and how it reaches already into every school, into every business, into every single part of the economy. I think we're all invested in the digital sector in trying to diversify the economy a bit and if we can do that by transitioning people from different sectors into the digital sector, we think that's only going to be good for the island uh, long term. I think the Academy has been ushering people from the third industrial revolution of computers into the fourth so that people are introduced to the ideas of automisation and connectivity. We're also working closely with schools and organisations like Women in Tech to make sure that the generations of the future are coming through here. I'm really interested in how uh, emerging companies, digital companies, startups are being promoted in Jersey and what Jersey can do for them. Air quality matters to anybody who lives in an urban environment. This will be the world's first jurisdiction-wide air quality monitoring network and going on from there, the world's first integrated environmental data network. I think it demonstrates the power of the community when brought together on their own terms over a short space of time, given some incredible tools, pooling their knowledge into what they can really do, the complexity of the problems we can solve, and just the fun we can have doing it. It's been brilliant, and I think what we really need to do is get some of these ideas in front of the state of Jersey, head towards our target 2030 being carbon neutral. 2019 was a big year of growth and change and investment for Digital Jersey. We delivered much more of what the local tech community needs in terms of workspaces, support and staff training. We showcased our unique digital credentials off island, helping to bring in businesses, skills and investment. We also worked with organisations like Tech Nation to have a bit of a deeper look at the Jersey digital economy to demonstrate to people here that the three pillars of our economy now really are finance, tourism and digital.